Hi there, and welcome back to Give 84 Gaming and another video response. So I've got three video responses to do. Um, I'm going to try and get them all done today. Uh, the first video response I want to do is the console that I want to add to my collection. And it was posted by the Nerdy Geezer. Um, I'm really enjoying these community challenges because we get to find more um, creators and more content to watch. I found this, I, f I found the Nerdy Geezer through a, I believe it was a Sega Zombie shout out. So the console that I want to add to my collection would be the Sega Dreamcast. Um, I know it's not a particularly rare console to get, but it's just a console I want to add. I remember having lots of fun playing the uh, Dreamcast when I was younger. I do have three games for the Dreamcast. And these are the games that I've got here. I remember this game quite fondly, which was Soldier of Fortune. I remember playing this quite a lot when I was younger, um, and I particularly remember like you could blow <laughs> blow the parts off of the uh, your enemies. And as a teenage boy, that's all you kind of wanted to do was um, uh, blow limbs off of the characters and things like that. It's quite gory, so I think this game is pretty cool. So I'd like to give this a wee, a wee blast again. The next game I've got for it is Choo Choo Rocket, which is a classic little. Um, Multiplayer puzzle game, Future Rockets class, uh, really good fun, good laugh, and just typical kind of Sega kind of game. And then we've got Shenmue. So Shenmue is a game that passed me by. I, I haven't really sat down to play it. Um, I don't think it's everyone's cup of tea. I do want to play it because um, it's one of the games you have to play, isn't it? I think I think it is a really good game. What I did play of it was just little bits and bit parts here and there with my friends. Then we'd go to the kind of arcade bits, you could play, I think it was Super Hang On or, and Space Harrier in the little arcade that you go to in the game. And it was pretty cool. But yeah, I want to go back and give Shim you a good, a good go through. The games that I don't have, but I do remember Fancy Star Online. It was a brilliant game. I would prefer to get that for the, the GameCube though, because I think. Uh, you could do the split screen on the GameCube, and that's pretty cool. Play that with my little brother quite a bit when, when we were younger. Toy Commander, I remember playing that a lot. Toy Commander was a good laugh. Um, basically, you control little toys, and you can uh, it's like death match. You just fly around shooting each other, which is really cool. And then the broken mess that was uh, Sonic Adventure. I loved Sonic Adventure. Thought it was brilliant. The camera, the camera controls in it were terrible. Um, but I love the music, I love the presentation of it. Uh, the little chows as well with your wee VMU unit. Um, training them up and things like that, so the Sonic Adventure was brilliant. I recently checked on my PS3 download history, so I've got Sonic Adventure on the PS3, but I'd love to play it natively on the, the Dreamcast. Um, so hopefully, I've written my Santa list, so hopefully Santa's really good to me this year, and he brings me a Sega Dreamcast, which would be pretty cool. So because this is a community challenge, it's open to everyone, we'd like to hear some more people's views on what they want, what console they'd want to add to their collection. Um, if I have to nominate somebody, I would like to nominate that UK gamer. Um, congratulations firstly on getting your 200 uh, subscribers and I can't wait to see your nursery rhymes karaoke video. But yeah, what console would you like to add to your collection? Thank you very much. Take care. Cheers.